this is an ex this is an example of a money application. So you're selling tickets, you're buying hot dog buns. The school play sells 156 tickets to a play. Adult tickets cost $15 and student tickets cost $8. The drama department brings in 1,822 from ticket sales. How many of each type of ticket were sold? So again, you answer the question. You, and you define your variables by answering the question. How many of each type? Well, one type X is going to be student. Let's actually make it adult because that came first in our problem. So this is adult tickets and student tickets. This is very similar to a mixture problem. If I set up a chart, kind of like I did for a mixture problem, you're going to combine the adult and the student to be a total. And they talk about two things, just as if, just as in our mixture problems, we have an amount. And then we're also talking about money in this problem. We talk about the amount of tickets sold. The school play sells 156 tickets. The total amount of tickets is 156. The adult, the number adult plus the number of student equals 156. So that's one of our equations. Now, the second is money. Adult tickets are $15. So the amount of revenue I bring in, $15 times the amount of tickets I have sold. Student tickets cost $8. The amount they cost times the number that I've sold is going to tell you how much total money. How much total money did I bring in? 1,822. So you now have 15x plus 8y equals 1,822. Since the coefficients on the top equation are both 1, solve for a variable. If I solve that for y, y is going to equal 156 minus x. Substitute this into the second equation for y. So I have 15x plus 8. You have to substitute it into the other one. So 156 minus x equals 1,822. So now it's just a matter of multiplying through. 15x plus. So we're going to multiply 8 times 156, and that's going to be 1,248 minus 8x equals 1,822. Combine the 15x and the 8x. So 15x minus 8x is 7x. That's 1,248 equals 1,822. Subtract the 1,248 from both sides. I get 574. I divide by 7. I get 82. So x is 82. So I've sold 82 adult tickets. The total amount is 156. We're using this equation here to get the number of student. The number of student is going to be 156 minus 82. 156 minus 82 is 74. So I have sold 
74 student tickets. And that is the total amount of our tickets sold. Now you should have 82 plus 74 is 156, and that does work out when you take and you multiply 82 times 15 plus 8 times 74, that should be 1,822, and that also works out.